Gut health topics and advice are surging in popularity, but there's a simple solution for where to find the best source of information. There is a lot of excitement, and where there's a lot of excitement, there are a lot of voices, and it can be really confusing uh, to know which uh, place to turn. I think a good place to start is always um, with your physician. What are signs of poor gut health? The obvious thing is if you have unhappy bowel movements, um, and so constipation, diarrhea, uh, are two of those things that you might experience, or abdominal pain. Um, you know, even upper symptoms like heartburn uh, are also related to poor gut health. What should I know about probiotics? There are tons and tons of over-the-counter probiotics that you can get either in the refrigerated section or just unrefrigerated off the shelf at the pharmacy or supermarket. Um, the problem with a lot of those is they're not really highly regulated, so you don't know really what you're getting. How about fermented foods? In terms of fermented foods, I kind of call those nature's probiotic. Um, and in some ways, it's, it's the sort of perfect probiotic because it's those microbes, those little bugs, that are all in the right combinations, in the right community, that come packaged with the foods that they like to eat and the things that they make uh, that help support our health. Um, and so nature has kind of figured it out already. Uh, and that's things like yogurts, kimchi, um, sauerkraut, kombucha, as long as it's all um, lower in sugar, um, these are great things to eat and they support a healthy microbiome in the gut. I kind of distill it down into an acronym for like four M's, molecules, microbes, movement, and mind. And the food is the, the molecules piece. But there's three other pillars that are incredibly important for your gut health. Uh, and that is microbes, or your microbiome. Um, movement or exercise, and then mind, which would be things like good sleep and mindfulness. And truly, uh, the research is actually supporting how these other pillows of health are also really important for your gut.